Hi, I'm Jennifer Butcher. I'm the pediatric psychologist in the CF program at the University of Michigan. And today we're gonna to talk about pill swallowing. The way that we recommend that kids practice, it's something they can do at home. And we recommend that they use candies. That way, if they take several in a row, it won't do any harm to them. So the steps involve having your child sit up straight um, in a chair and just first start with having them take a drink of water. So what you wanna do is teach them that their throat and their tongue is like the water slide and the pill is like the rider. So what they wanna do is wash the rider down the slide. Then the next step would be to start with a small candy. So you wanna build on success. So we usually recommend starting with sprinkles. So you start with a tiny sprinkle and what you want them to do is put it on the middle of their tongue and then take a drink of water. If they're able to do that, um, you can move on to a slightly larger candy. If they aren't able to do that, you stick with that step until they're successful. The next step could be something like a mini M&M, or that might be too big, it could be a larger sprinkle. So you just move forward and have them practice until they're able to swallow that size a few times. And then you move up to the size of their actual pill or capsule. So if it's an enzyme, something like a Good and Plenty or a Tic Tac might be about that right size. And you have them swallow that several times. If they aren't able to swallow that size, you just move back to the size they were last successful at and have them do that a couple more times and then you end. So you want them to end feeling good about their, their skills. Usually practice should only be about five minutes at a time. You don't wanna make this something that feels like work to them, it should be fun. Um, and sometimes we recommend families give their kids stickers or something as a reward for, for their hard work learning to swallow pills. 